Hi guys! I'm vlogging on my EPL7. Finally! I finally have one that works. Um, and it's Monday night. Welcome to a new weekly vlog. Um, what time is it? 10 to 7. I'm just waiting for my mum. She's going to pick me up from Joe's and then I am going home, having some tea and I'm probably having a bath because as you all know I like a bath and Joe doesn't have a bath. So I think I'm going to have a bath. How many times can I say bath in this one sentence? Um, so yeah, it's been a really good day at work today actually. Um, it went really quickly, which I am okay with on a Monday. And yeah, it's just been very, very nice. Um, so I'm actually quite looking forward to going home. I'm going to miss Joe because I do miss him when I'm not here. But it's nice to see my family sometimes. <laughs> um, and you know, baths. Sorry Joe. And um, this camera is really heavy compared to my iPod and I keep having to swap arms. Um, so yeah, I will vlog the bath and, and, and that. And there's nothing else really to say at this present moment in time apart from look how nice the quality is on my camera. It's very exciting. Um, so yeah, I'll see you in a little bit. So I'm at my mum's now and I'm just about to go for a bath. Um, there we go, <laughs> the lighting's rubbish in here. Um, and I'm trying to decide what to watch on Netflix and I can't decide. It's a hard decision. But um, I don't actually have any bath bombs to use because I've got loads of the Valentine's range but I haven't, I'm gonna do a um, haul video and I haven't filmed it yet so I can't use any of them. So I'm gonna have to use up um, Candy Mountain because I've still got some left. So that's fine with me because I love Candy Mountain. Um, I was kind of in the mood for a bath bomb rather than a bubble bar, but never mind. Um, so I need to decide what to watch on Netflix and then I'm going to go run a bath because that is what Monday nights are for. I've had my bath! Um, and I feel all shiny and clean and lovely. Um, I've had a face mask on. The Una Brennan Super Facialist Salicylic Acid something or other wash. <laughs> it's got a really long name. Um, but I've used that face mask tonight. So super clean. Um, I haven't washed my hair because I'm trying to do this thing where I don't wash it as often. So it means that I have to really dry shampoo the hell out of my hair for quite a few days. But it is making it less greasy so it's working but it just means like now which is like it's third day now tomorrow will be it's third day um, it means it's getting quite greasy and um, now I'm vlogging on my Olympus I realise when I'm looking at my screen I'm actually really not looking anywhere near you um, whereas when I was on my iPod um, if I was looking at the screen I was still kind of looking into the camera so I'll try my best to look at the um, lens but no promises, because I've got to get used to it first. Like, I'm really not used to this yet. So I want to eat the schedule for tomorrow, which is a very nice feeling. So I've got quite a busy day at work tomorrow. And um, I have just... That's a point. Let me show you. I have just hit 200 likes. That's really exciting for me. It's my first ever... Look at that. It's my first ever... 200 like photo on Instagram and it's my lush one so that's very exciting Um, so I'm really happy with that like it's always the little things that make me really happy like it's just it's very nice I really like that photo as well Um, so yeah all my tweets are scheduled I had a really nice night with mum and Ethan and Ruby it is nice to be home sometimes although I do miss Joe and I'm not there and I am very excited to properly move in with him it's just it's nice to be home sometimes so Hi guys, it's Tuesday now and I'm still at my house, not Joe's house, um, and I've just got home from work, it's 10 to 7, um, so I'm currently kind of scavenging for some tea and I can't decide what I want. I'm sorry, I'm not looking at the lens again, I keep forgetting. Um, I can't decide what I want, I think I want something really shit, like a, like a big pizza or like... Yeah, probably just a big pizza. I think that's what I want. Um, so, I don't know what we've got. I will have to have a look in a minute when I can properly see when I'm not talking to you guys. So how are you all? Um, I'm um, working from home tomorrow in the morning because tomorrow is the day of my endoscopy. I don't know if you remember, but um, in a, one of my Vlogmas vlogs a while ago, I was at the doctor's 
and I said that I um, get really bad like indigestion and heartburn and um, so I'm on medication for it and um, the, I went to see a new doctor and they finally uh, sort of sending me some tests to actually see the cause of it rather than just treating the symptoms so that's really good I'm really happy about it but um, I've got this endoscopy tomorrow and I had a phone call with a woman from the clinic last week and it was like uh, answer all these questions about yourself so we can jot it down on a form da 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 da, da. like almost like a pre-op but not for a natural op so that was all fine and dandy and then the letter for the endoscopy came through yesterday um, and it says on the letter um, please stop these medications seven days prior to the procedure and one of the medications is the one that I'm on for my digestion she didn't tell me on the phone and the letter only came through two days before the friggin procedure so I've been taking it because no one told me otherwise so if I get there tomorrow now and they're like oh we can't do it because you're still on your medication I'm gonna go ape shit because I've like had to take an afternoon off work and it's just it's a right hassle um, so yeah, I'm a little bit annoyed actually that the woman on the phone was such a useless bint. Did tell me. But then I'm worried as well that like if I have been on the pills, then it'll show the results differently to what it would if I hadn't. So it'll show that I'm okay when I'm not. If that makes sense. So I don't know. I'm just really annoyed, and I'm actually really nervous. Like. Not about the procedure, like, I've had tubes down my nostrils and my throat and stuff in the past and it's uncomfortable but it, you can deal with it, but um, I've just, I don't like hospitals in general and I just, they make me very anxious, so I'm a little bit flustered today and I think I'll be the same tomorrow to be honest until it's all over. Um, but I will keep you guys updated because, I don't know, like, my favourite vlogs are ones where people are really open and really honest about stuff and all about their life and don't really cut anything out, unless it's like, really TMI, like. But, so I kind of want to be that sort of vlogger and like actually tell you about my life, not like cut things out because I don't, I don't know, you know, you know what I mean. Um, so, now I've had that little ramble, <laughs> um, I'm going to have a look for some food and I'm going to edit the vlog tonight because it's Tuesday and it's vlog editing day, so that's very nice. Um, yeah, and then I'm going to go to bed because I can't eat after 7am tomorrow because my endoscopy is at 2 um, so I need to get up before 7 and have something to eat, otherwise I will die. <laughs> I cannot go without food. Um, so I was going to have a lion until like 8 o'clock because it's because uh, I'm working from home. But now I can't. I've got to eat before 7, so I'm probably going to be up at half 6. Yay! Um, and remember I said that I'm trying this thing where I'm trying... Oh, what am I doing with the light? It's bad lighting in here. Um, where I'm trying this thing where I'm not washing my hair as much in an attempt to make it less greasy and to sort of get it used to not being washed but it's got to the stage now where my scalp's like itching me because it's so easy to wash and it's got so much dry shampoo on it so I'm gonna have to shower first thing in the morning yeah I'm just in one of those moods today I'm a bit like frustrated with people so Gah. work was really stressful today which hasn't helped the situation at all so yeah Looking forward to editing the vlog and having some quality time with my ruby and maybe devouring an entire pizza in about 30 seconds. I decided upon the pepperoni pizza, <clears throat> excuse me, and um, I've coated it, it's already a pepperoni pizza, and I've coated it in, mind my disgusting nail, I've coated it in um, salami and shit tons of cheese because when you're in a bad mood, what can fix you better than salty processed meats, dairy, and carbs apart from chocolate which I will probably be eating afterwards because YOLO god I just said YOLO <laughs> but yeah I'm so excited for to devour this like you, I can't even tell you like look at the beauty of the pizza ah oh. iMovie won't open iMovie won't open <laughs> I'm in such a bad mood guys and this is so not what I need right now Ooh, zoomed Oh no, oh no, I zoomed. Just, you know when you're just in one of those moods, I'm like sat on the floor waiting for my pizza to cook and iMovie won't open and I need to edit my vlog and I just, and there's no one home so I can't moan at anyone. <laughs> I'm just in one of those moods. Oh jeez, this pizza better cheer me up. Like, if it doesn't, I'm just, I'm just, I've lost all hope for my sanity. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. I'm just sat on the floor just trying to get iMovie to work so I can edit my vlog. It's such a simple task. 
morning guys, um, it's Wednesday now, it's about half past eight um, I've just had to import all of my videos from Monday and Tuesday off my camera onto my laptop because um, I was just filming this little intro and it was like, memory card full! Ah, shit! I forgot to get a new memory card when I decided to vlog on this so, because um, the files are so much bigger than on my iPod um, so I need to get a new memory card so that doesn't always happen so that is a job to do this week <coughs> Um, so I'm working from home today because I've got my endoscopy at 2. So I've been up since half past 6 because I wasn't allowed to eat anything after 7am because of the endoscopy. So I'm going to be hungry soon. <laughs> but um, it meant that I got some food in otherwise I'd have died. I don't do well without food, especially not without breakfast. Um, so since half 6 I have uploaded my YouTube video, my um, last week's vlog. That's scheduled for 6 o'clock tonight and I'm just about to go through and edit the um, description box. Um, and then come 9 o'clock I will be working, but I'll be working on my sofa watching Jeremy Kyle. So who is the real winner here? <laughs> this is why I would love a job that like allows me to work from home. I work so much better from home. I always have done. Um, just sat in PJs with a cup of tea, although I'm not allowed tea. I'm only allowed water now from 7am until after my, treat my, after my treatment, after my procedure at 2, I'm only allowed water, I'm going to die, <laughs> I'm going to be so hungry. So I'm working obviously, um, I'm just taking a quick break to get a drink and go for a wee and this morning's on in the background and there's this woman and she thinks she can tell, she can predict the future with vegetables and I swear to god I'm like in tears here laughing. She just threw asparagus on the table and was like Mad Max is going to win an Oscar and I was just like what is going on? She's a bloody nutter. Oh my god it's just daytime TV like I forgot how incredible it is. It's just not like anything else is it? Throwing asparagus on the table to predict the future like I hadn't heard that one before. Hello! <laughs> it's um Thursday Thursday today. Thursday. It's Thursday today. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday afternoon because I was in a really horrible mood because the endoscopy was so bad. Like it was so so bad. Yeah, I don't know what you're on about. You were totally treat yesterday. It was honestly it was the worst experience of my whole life. Like it was horrible. Um they wouldn't sedate me, so I had to have a throat spray and I just had like a full blown panic attack and it was just it was a horrible, horrible day. So I was really not in the mood to do anything last night other than curl up in bed and watch Pretty Little Liars. So that's why I didn't vlog. Um, so yeah, the today has been quite good in comparison. Um, I've got like crazy shoulder ache now though because I always like really tense up if I'm really anxious. So then my shoulders start to ache the next day. Um, but yeah, today has been good. Um, I have a blog post going out tomorrow because I didn't have one going out today because I didn't really write one last night. Um, and I swear I was going to tell you something and I can't remember what it was. And it's Friday tomorrow and it's payday tomorrow. And I'm sorry, I'm doing the thing. I'm looking at the screen, not the lens. I'm still getting used to vlogging on this Should camera. Like, click up here. Like, look. like a cat. <laughs> no. I like cats. <laughs> That's nice. But I'm not a cat. Okay. Um, so yeah, what was I saying? I don't know, no, I was saying something after the car. It's payday Friday, tomorrow. It's, payday, it's yeah. Friday and it's payday and it's it's a good day. Um, Friday. I'm very, I'm very excited. I've just ordered myself two new memory cards for my camera because this one keeps getting full really quickly because the vlog files are so so huge. So I've ordered myself one. I've ordered myself two 64 gigabyte memory cards. <laughs> one, yeah, one is for vlog files and photos. So I can just keep it in all the time. I don't have to worry about taking it out. And the other one is for YouTube videos that I'm gonna actually properly film. So, yeah, that will mean that I don't actually run out of space, which will be good. So, um, until I try and remember what it was I was going to tell you, I will be on my merry way, and I will touch base again soon. Hope you all had a lovely Thursday. Evening, it's Friday, yay! yay! Just very excited about being in Friday as well. And if you notice how shiny my cheeks are, and how horrendously orange they look, isn't that a good look? I've just been to the MAC counter in Harvey Nichols in Leeds because um, I needed some more foundation and she was like, oh, I'll put some bronzer on you and I looked at it and I was like, it's very dark. I was like, I'm very pale. She was like, it'll look fine. And then I stepped out of the shop and looked at my face and I was like, holy shit, I look like I have orange stripes on my cheeks. <laughs> so I was on the train on the way home, like really paranoid that someone was just going to be like staring at me because I was such a friggin' idiot. But the foundation is absolutely gorgeous and I also bought a brush 
and she also undercharged me. <laughs> so I didn't know she'd undercharged me until the foundation's £25 and the brush, I didn't know how much the brush was, um, but the final bill came to £35. So I was like, that doesn't sound right. MAC brushes are quite expensive. Um, I thought the brush would maybe be about 20 quid, um, but then I googled it and it's a £30 brush. Because I never pay £30 for a brush, Jesus. The pack of Zoeva brushes is 50 quid. I'd rather spend an extra 20 and get that. But so if my final bill had come to like the what would it have been, 55 quid, I would have been like, ha, put that brush back. But it only came to 35 pounds. So I thought the brush was just cheaper than I expected. And then I looked online, it's supposed to be 30 quid. So bargain of the day. It's the MAC 130 brush and it looks really tiny but she used it on my foundation and it was like, I don't know, I just can't even tell, it was like the hand of God it made my skin look amazing. You can tell, look how, look how good my skin looks apart from the orange. So it's the Pro Longwear Nourishing Waterproof Foundation that I got. Never tried this one but she put it on me and it looked amazing. So amazing. high hopes. Because when I got the Charlotte Tilbury one that I hate, she literally just put it on my cheek and was like, it looks fine. I was like, okay. So I shouldn't have bought it really. But she's put this one on my entire face and I really like it. So that's good. Um, so it's Friday and it's ten, five to seven. And I'm gonna go for a shower because I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. I like going to the hairdressers with clean hair. Like, I feel like if I go, like a greasy mask will really judge me. So even though they wash my hair when I get there, I like to go to the hairdressers with clean hair. I usually wash it the night before. That's the most backwards thing ever. <laughs> I, like to go, I like to go to the hairdressers with a full face of makeup as well. Because then when you come out you look amazing. Yeah, <laughs> because you've got like nice hair and makeup. Like, come off. No. Nice. Like washing your face. You don't wash your face. Why well. would the hairdresser wash my face? Maybe because you're all greasy. Like you just have to wear then. Oh, well, I'm not all greasy because I'm in the shower. I just can't. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go shower. And then we're going to drink wine. And watch something. Don't know you're what getting you. used to holding it. Yeah, but it makes my arm hurt. I know, but you're like, you're getting more used to it. Yeah, but it makes my arm hurt. Swapsies. I've already swapsized. Yeah, the camera's quite, it's not even a heavy camera, it's a really light camera, but I'm used to my iPod, which is like, it Why? doesn't wear anything. <laughs> so holding this up is actually hurting a little bit. But yeah, so I'm gonna go wash off my orange cheeks now. You know. Look at it, look at it, it looks ridiculous. <laughs> Okay. Look how cosy I look. <laughs> I look like a little worm. All wrapped up in my duvet. Um, we're sat and Josie in pick and mix. And I'm eating gold bears. And we're drinking wine. And that singing in the background is actually um, the rescuers. Flirt. Bianca's such a flirt. I ship Bianca and Bernard. They're cute. And we are watching The Rescuers because it's on Netflix. And I watched this film a few years ago for the first time in ages. And I just then realised like how friggin' dark it is. Like, oh yeah, we'll just kidnap this orphan and force her down a hole where she nearly dies. Oh, and if she does anything wrong, then we'll just set the alligators on her. Like. It's so dark. It seems like a really good parental model to me. A good parental model. Mm. So yeah, happy Friday everybody. I like our Fridays. I bet they don't have discipline problems with Penny. <laughs> oh girl. Um, yeah, happy Friday. I like our Fridays. It usually consists of alcohol bed and a Disney film. It does. I think that's a really good way to spend a Friday. Yeah. Happy Friday. 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 I'm enjoying vlogging on my Olympus. It's nice quality. Even when you move it, like it's it's not shaky. Like my iPod was shaky. This isn't shaky. Shaky. Shaky.
Mallorca. Fuck's sake, maybe I will do it. One second. Evening! <laughs> I thought it was brighter than it was, but it was darker than I thought. So I've um, taken the lid thing off of Joe's lamp so it, you can actually see me even though I look bright yellow. <laughs> so hello, happy Saturday. I haven't really vlogged today um, because I went to get my hair done. Doesn't it look lovely and like my roots are gone and it's shorter. Um, so I went to get my hair done and it took longer than I thought so then we had to rush to go to Leeds because um, we were meeting my friend Rosie which you will have briefly seen in the very very small amount of vlog footage I got from Almost Famous where we went for tea. Um, Rosie is pretty much one of my best friends. Um, we've known each other since year seven so which we worked out tonight is about what did I say? 11 years? 11 years. 11 years. Nearly 12. Nearly 12 years we've been friends. So, And she lives in London now, so I very rarely get to see her. So she came up for the weekend and it was so, so nice to see her. I love her so much. Um, so we went to Almost Famous and had burgers and cocktails, so it was really lovely. Hi guys! Um, so I'm just taking some blog photos. As you can probably see all my stuff. La la la. Um, and then I'm filming a YouTube video, so I'm really excited. And um, you can see my hair a lot better in this light today. Look, it's a lot shorter and it's a lot blonder. So I really love her. Um, yeah, so I'm taking some blog photos, then filming a video, and then me and Joe are going to go to the gym. So pray for Joe, pray for Rihanna. Not looking forward to it. <laughs> so yeah. Hello, hello, hello. Um, so we've taken all our. Oh, yeah. Hi, Joe. Oh, wait. There we go in the background and um, we've taken all our blog photos and I filmed a video and we were gonna go to the gym but we didn't really have time I know that sounds really bad and like a really lame excuse but we are gonna go tomorrow after work instead because it makes more sense because we're at Joe's grandma's for tea tonight so I didn't really want to have all my makeup on for the video then take it off for the gym and then put it back on like it just seemed really annoying so yeah we're being bad we're going tomorrow instead um, but we are going tomorrow, so that's fine. So we are sat in bed now, um, eating these. Oh, we're going to be eating these in a minute. These Lint chocolates that I got sent very kindly from Lint. And um, we're watching The Big Fat Quiz of Everything, which was on a few weeks ago, and we haven't watched it yet. So whilst Joe's doing some blogging. So yeah, it's been a really nice Sunday actually, although the weekends go too quickly at the moment. It doesn't feel like it should be Monday tomorrow yet. It's a little bit annoying, but yeah, so that's 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 our plans for today. Evening everyone! Um, so I'm really sorry I haven't vlogged very much today. Um, it's been a bit of a weird one, it's been very busy. Um, we've just got back from Joe's grandma's, for we've been for a meal, and um, we are about to go to bed. It's quarter past eleven, so I'm absolutely knackered, and we've got work tomorrow, so... You know, <laughs> perils of going out on a Sunday, of having a social life with Joe's grandparents? That count as a social life <laughs> um, so um yeah we're having a bit of a nightmare at the moment because the boiler has a massive leak in it so we have no hot water so we can't shower Ugh, so that really sucks and um, so we're gonna try and ask our friend rosie if we can go shower at hers tomorrow night she only lives down the road so because we don't know when it's going to be fixed joe's dad's going to go out of the park because joe's dad's a plumber we're gonna go out of the park tomorrow, but it might not be in stock, so we don't know when we're gonna have hot water. So, you know, it could be worse, but it's not ideal. That's a bit of a nightmare. But, like I said, it could be worse. So, it's Sunday night, which means it is the end of another vlog. Cannot believe how quickly these weeks are going. It's kind of weird. How many, how many has it been now? This is number four. No way! This is number four. That's weird, isn't it? Um, so yeah, uh, thank you so so much for watching. I hope you really really enjoyed it. Um, next week it's going to be quite a busy one, so it might be a little bit more entertaining than this week's. And I have an actual real non-vlog YouTube video going up for you on Sunday. So I'm really excited and I hope you're really excited. So make sure you subscribed so you don't miss it. Um, I'm actually really sort of edging towards 700 subscribers now so I kind of really really want to get there so if you're not already subscribed please please do it would make my absolute day um, give us a thumbs up and share with your friends and all that um, if yeah you have any. if you have any obviously if you're not like me and Joe and our social life is going to Joe's grandparents for tea 
<laughs> so have a fantastic week and all you know those lovely merry thoughts and I will see you on Sunday for a new video and next Wednesday at 6pm for another vlog. Thank you so much for watching guys, I'll see you later. Bye! So today we've been for a walk in the snow and it was really fun. Bye!